My name is Veronica Peterson. In 2006, I purchased my first home with Washington Mutual. And at that time, the mortgage industry was taken up. It was teeter-tottering back and forth. And I found out later that my um, that um, my business was taking a hit because of the economy. And I lost clients. I was self-employed, family child care provider for 11 years. And I worked that business for 11 years. Um, I got into trouble with my payments and tried a modification. Washington Mutual uh, took me through the channels of modification. However, that was of no avail. Um, I had a gentleman tell me that he would purchase the home, which was a realtor, and he would uh, allow me to rent the property. I found out on January the 24th of 2008 that my home was going to be auctioned at Howard County Courthouse. And the gentleman's wife showed up to purchase the home to make a bid. And she was told that she, she was not going to be able to purchase the house because they were going to take the bid at some astronomical figure that they were not willing to submit an offer for. So the home foreclosed and I got in contact with the ACORN organization and they combed through the loan and they were able to find all types of discrepancies with uh, my income, with my credit score matching the interest rate and some other things that were that was really fraud in the loan and um, Long Beach Mortgage Company was the uh, I believe the um, broker that serviced the loan and Washington Mutual and they both uh, believe is now foreclosed on I'm, I'm sorry uh, I think it went bankrupt bankrupt, bankrupt yes JP Morgan has purchased that company now but at the time I was told to go through the Hope Now program St. Ambrose I called all every number that you could think of I called it um, I was given a list of referrals <clears throat> and with that list of referrals I was given additional list of referrals and it got to the point where they were just referring me back and forth to one another and I stayed on the phone long periods of time with the Hope Now program um, Hope Now was not Hope Now, it was not Hope Later, it was Hope Never um, and from there um, it was just a downward spiral till I met Acorn and they were able to go into courtroom with me and we presented what we found in the loan to the judges here in the state of Maryland and they were told that it was no longer a state issue, that it was a federal issue.